so much for that. Let's see. First of all, it helps turn on the airplane. Yeah, Mike, that much aileron is uh, a roll per second. Hold that for me while I get this thing out of here. Ready? Okay, Steve, it's going to be put it in the weeds. You want to get out of the way? That's what the video's for. 
Okay, let's go find... With all this tall grass, I succeeded in missing all of it. That's actually not too bad. Broke yet another engine mount. Broke one wing off. Broke two wings off. Okay, we're done for the day. No, I mean, the main problem is figuring out, you know, go look at all the videos, see what it did. Uh -huh. Did you get anything good on the takeoff? On the takeoff, yeah, I think. Yeah, no, it wouldn't good. do any good you once you're up it, and going. Right? Let's see. Oh, cool. That's a perfect shot. And I, when I was going through the transition, I was trying various combinations on the uh, the I inbound. The, uh, the concern I had uh, probably was justified. What we're probably getting is uh, a center section stall at low power, high angle of attack, which is costing a lot of the center section control. So I think the fix is to put the uh, leading edge slots. So you, I, I wasn't paying too much attention because I didn't know exactly when the transitions were occurring, but you had throttled back when you pulled up? Is that what you're saying? Uh, yeah. And you've got to do that, otherwise you end up uh, climbing like crazy through the transition, uh -huh. which may be a very viable strategy, but I, yeah. I would rather it not be the required strategy. Right. Uh -huh. You know, w one approach is you just come in, do a symmetric pull to vertical, mm -hmm. and, and then... Uh, That's what the pogo did and stuff, right? Yeah, but that then means you have to do a, a long back down. Yeah, right. That's what they did. It's not necessarily what you want to do. <laughs> well, they're the ones who proved that it didn't really work. The gyros for the center section are all in here. These are the three controller units. Uh, you can see one sensor right there, the other two are in underneath it because they all have to be perpendicular to each other. And then these two gyros control the roll on the outer wing panels.